We're gonna do the uh, box review of the JBL. Is it the David by Harman Flip Four Bluetooth waterproof Bluetooth speaker? Like I tested yesterday, they say it, like it has more deeper bass than my other two soundbots, which are pretty good. I actually like this speaker though. So like YouTubers, I would definitely highly recommend getting it. If you got Amazon, it may be a little expensive on Amazon, which I'll check later. This is just to protect it from, like, damage and stuff when they, they ship it. Here's this. Let me see if I can pull it out. It's hard to do with the camera, so I have to bear with me. This speaker right here is awesome. Like, if you have a max volume, but I'll tell you the max, the max volume is it. This right here has it's 16 watts of power. Yeah, it's 16 watts of power, which means it has two 8-watt speaker drivers. I'm not sure what inch they are. I'll say they're probably 2 or 2.25-inch speaker drivers. And here's the two passive subwoofers. One right here and one right here. I'll show you when it's connected. First, I got to turn off one of my other Bluetooth speakers so I can tell you when it's connected. Okay. The battery indications on the side. This little button, I just figured out that you could hear. Let me see if you can see it. Alright. All right. This button right here, you can pair sync with other JBL Bluetooth speakers. Alright, here's on. Oh, I love that sound. That sound means it's connected. So let me turn off my Bluetooth. Now I'll show you what looks like when it's disconnected. Alright, let me show Here's the sound with disconnected. Usually it will show it, but... I'll show you the sound where it's off. This is there. But otherwise, I like the speaker. Let's see what's it. This box. I think this one's probably that charger I got for the JBL. Yep. It's a, the charger. No adapter, but you... I could just use my iPhone adapter. There's my new phone, the iPhone 6S Plus. It's a good phone too. If you want to get the, if you have the iPhone 6S Plus, how tell me how you do in the description below. Yeah, let's see if I can get the box in there. But it is a good speaker. Just let me see if I can get that box. Cause sometimes I have a hard time getting the box. In. But otherwise, I do like the speaker. You little box, it's so cute. I love the color. I lo I love the style of the box too. Like I love the style pattern for the JBL four. It is a good speaker. Like these right here on the side are two passive subwoofers. These are for the deep bass, which is pretty good. This one right here is play pause. This one's Bluetooth symbol. But this one right here, you see that it applies to my YouTubers. This one right here is the upper of your volume or lower your volume. If you put a max volume, it'll sound like a car subwoofer for reals. But I will highly recommend the Bluetooth, the JBL, because it is good. Like it beats my other two soundbots. Like my other soundbots are one is 12 watt and one is 10 watt. But this one right here is 16 watts. So it beats the other two. And the little one that I'm using to record this stuff is only like 6 watts. But it's still, the other Bluetooth speakers are still good. Even with the Mega Bass that I'm using right now, I would still highly recommend it, too. Because the Mega Bass is just as loud, too. So, like, com Alright, let me put this away. Yeah. Like, comment, and subscribe to the daily videos.